This is the Drip Depot two zone kit for half inch tubing with canister filters. Items are shown in order of assembly. You want to check and make sure that the washer is in the Y faucet connector. The Y faucet connector is used to create two lines coming from a single faucet. Each line can be independently controlled. When attaching to your faucet, make sure you hand tighten the Y connector. Do not over tighten as this can crack the Y connector. The next items to be connected are the backflow preventers. You want to check and make sure that you have the green washer in each of them. Hand tighten the backflow preventers, one on each side of the Y. Do not over tighten. The next items are the canister filters. Each filter can be unscrewed and opened up, exposing the screen, which then can be removed for cleaning. You want to check for the washer in each filter. The cap at the bottom of each filter can be unscrewed and used for flushing out the filter if needed. The filter is then attached directly to the backflow preventer, one on each side. Again, only hand tighten. The next items are the pressure regulators. Again, check for the green washer in each before installing. If you do not have them, check your box to make sure they haven't fallen out during shipping. Uh, screw a pressure regulator onto each filter. Again, beware of over tightening, only hand tighten. The next items are the hose swivel adapters used to connect your tubing to your head assembly. To attach your tubing, screw the nut all the way back, exposing the barb. Push your tubing completely over the barb. Screw the nut forward. This locks the tubing in place. Now screw the swivel adapter onto each pressure regulator. This kit comes with permalock hose swivel adapters, which are reusable. And that completes the head assembly for each zone. The ruler in the video shows that the overall length for each side of the head assembly is about 12 inches.